Okay, just finishing up here on these notes for 1D, dealing with special right triangles. Um, there's obviously a lot of more that we could show as examples, but I think the easiest way is to just have you try them and see what you can do um, with lining up what formula needs to be used with what. Let me go over number 20 and then we'll we'll show you what all the answers are for this page. So when I'm looking at number 20 or any of these down here at the bottom where there's more than one triangle, I'm looking at the two different triangles and I can see I want to find X, Y, and Z. How do I know which one to start with? Do I start with this triangle here or do I start with this one on the right side? The best answer is to try start with the one that already has a side. If you notice here, this triangle, we don't know any of the numbers for any of the sides. But on this triangle, I do know that this leg is 32. So sometimes you might have to just cover up. Yes. Cover up, and now we're just going to look at this little 45, 45, right? Because if one is 45, they both are. We know the two legs are going to be the same. So this is going to be 32. We know the hypotenuse is the leg square root of 2. See how easy that was? We just got that first one done. Now we can come over to this side, and I know that this triangle is got a hypotenuse of 32. So the hypotenuse is 32. That means the short leg is half of that, which is 16. And the long leg, which is opposite the 60, is 16 square root of 3. So I'd have 32 square root of 2. I'd have 16 square root of 3. And I would have 16. So why don't you stop, do a couple of those examples that I have not gone through yet, and I will show you the answers. So stop the video and then take a look. Let me get these shortened up here. All right, so there are all the answers for this mixed um, notes up here, a mixed practice. So I'll just um, pause that. You can take a look at what the answers are and look at the ones that you did and see how how they match up. Um, this is probably one of the harder units, so if you have any questions, please let me know and we'll, we'll get you through it.